Uh, QAnon. We haven't really talked about QAnon. <laughs> no, Bart's no QAnon. we haven't. What's new in the world of QAnon? So what is QAnon, Darren? Just like a brief overview of it what... It is a conspiracy theory among uh, the far right wing element of the internet where there is a guy who supposedly calls himself Q and started posting, I think, on 8chan and would... And now, just if I could interject with a slight tangent, 8chan mm -hmm. is like 4chan's 4chan. It's, it's like... Double. It, it's like too crazy for 4chan, and 4chan is like the darkest depths of the internet. But this has not outgrown that to yeah. the point where your boomer uh, uncle knows about it. Sure, sure. And they think that Trump is like a secret uh, agent <laughs> who is like infiltrating the government and is going to take out pedophiles and uh, like every corrupt element of the United States government. Right. I don't know. Like only... Pizzagate. It started with yeah. Pizzagate, like that whole but... dumb thing where there was a pizzeria in Washington mm -hmm. where there was a basement where these Democratic <laughs> well, politicians go to out, rape. The point. only thing they got wrong was that it was in a pizza shop at this point with Jeffrey <laughs> Epstein. <laughs> My but... only question is why are pedophilia and corruption necessarily linked? I feel like you could be a pedophile that has complete integrity. Well, what? <laughs> Jesus Christ. I'm, listen, there's no. Just because you're a pedophile, you take bribes? Well, my bigger question is Trump was on the fucking rape island with Epstein. Yeah. Like, why is Research, he Research, Darren. He was right. working undercover. Deep cover. <laughs> he had to date 15 year old girls in order to take down the pedophiles. He was tagging oh, them. Yeah, he was yeah. tagging them to find them later on. <laughs> them. Like cows. Yeah. Like fucking homing for satin nets. <laughs> <laughs> So I think it's like to it's now just evolved into this crazy like these people who just think that everything is about child molestation. Mm -hmm. Anything that happens in politics of any kind is related to Q shit. Can I ask one question? What percentage of these QAnon people do you think themselves are child molesters? Mm. Uh, probably a good amount. Yeah, I wouldn't doubt it. I mean, so projection there. With that said, there is this woman. There is this clip now of this woman who is completely batshit. Here is. There is a longer clip. I want to play the shorter clip first. If we can get through the shorter clip, mm -hmm. we can do the longer one. And she's just like a random internet lady. She exactly. It's not Michelle Bachman. She was, and I believe she was banned from YouTube because her videos were so crazy, <laughs> so much so that she has moved on to Periscope, which is Twitter's live video app. Yeah. So here's a little sampling of her ramblings. They are putting children in your food. Those are pedophile codes. Wait, <laughs> pedophile codes? Right. And so there's a photo of a box of Pillsbury toaster strudel. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and you see like this. Does she think the Pillsbury Doughboy is a, is a child? No, 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 no. So you see this piece of strudel. <laughs> it's like a rectangular pastry. Right. And there is a very goofy looking swirl of icing two swirls made to look like eyes yeah. and then a goofy smile with a tongue sticking out all with icing and she's saying that's the code from isis to be fair later in the video there is a pop tart with a diaper on it hold on <laughs> let's yeah. let so let's let's get back here they are putting children in your food those are pedophile codes <laughs> pedophile codes if twitter won't let me if Twitter will not let me. So pedophiles post. now want to eat children? Not They're just recru them? recruiting them, I They're guess. So Too once fun. you get once you eat a child and you get that taste, you want to have sex with them? Oh, well, now, yeah. So I that's that's the that's, that's a great point. Not only do they want to <laughs> fuck them, they want to eat them. I eat too. bacon all the time. I've never wanted to fuck a pig. Like, it <laughs> I don't think it works like that. Well, I mean, I guess maybe I just haven't met the right pig. <laughs> Yeah, gotta, I will fight back right and way. show you on Periscope in real live time. What does that look like to you? In so your I wanna, I, By the way, I've been meaning to uh, spring this on you. I uh -oh. want you and I to be partners in a new uh, pig fucking app. It's called Oinker. <laughs> oh, no. Would you be that interested? Has, that has to already exist. It's a new startup. I'm, I'm in. Okay. I'm cool. in. Are we'll there a lot of that. pigs on it? <laughs> well, not yet. We don't have, it's not up and running. Yeah, you got to get that venture capital money yeah, first. We need the infrastructure. Once Tom Steyer drops out of the race, we'll get his <laughs> whatever money he has left. Yeah, all we have to do is con him into thinking Bernie Sanders will be there. Because all he wants to do is like shake hands with be Bernie Sanders. With 
<laughs> and Bernie doesn't want anything. He's like, okay, good, yeah. But we'll just tell him. We'll just tell him that yeah. Bernie's going to be around, and then you know, we 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 get a finder's fee for introducing him to Bernie, and then we use that to start the app. And he doesn't have any concept of money, so we can just say one hundred seventy-five million dollars for Oinker. Dude. It is horrific. This is where I'm coming back at you, Illuminati. You. Fucking Beyonce. Take that. Yeah. <laughs> Got your ass on Periscope. Can I just say, can you imagine? Well, two things. First of all, <laughs> this is like a sort of addendum to what I, the other complaint I just brought up, which is that some conspiracy theories, I feel as nutty and stupid as they are, come from a good place like 9-11 truthers. I feel a lot of them, as dumb as that is, uh, they distrust the government, which is a valid thing to do, but they take it to like very unscientific and not well thought out places. And this, I feel, is the same thing in a way. It's sort of like, uh, you know, you, you hear about children being molested and you want that to stop and you think the people in your government are doing it. You want it to stop. But how does Trump become the avatar? Like, think of the think of the intellect that has to be behind someone that believes this, that fucking 80 IQ Donald Trump is the guy that's being drafted to take out pedophiles in the government. Well, but now even just that there's the, they're putting the children in the food, like it's evolved into something so like so beyond the realm of possibility. Why would they like what incentive does the pedophile have to put the child in the money? Food? But once, no, but like what, once it, you've baked the kid, you oh, can't fuck the kid anymore. Oh, it's but like also maybe if you the... eat kid, you you develop a need for pedophilia yourself. I don't know. They I want just... to recruit more pedophiles. Wouldn't they want all the kids to yeah, themselves? Why, like, yeah. Why? Yeah. Why ruin the party for you? I, maybe they would just want to normalize it. Well, let's hear. I'm from... finding a lot of holes in this yeah. narrative. Let's hear what Trudy has about pop tart children. And... Can we get her on the show? I would love to. I don't even know what her point is. She's not even making the point. Her She's point? The Stop point right. eating toaster strudel, Noah. No, here, here. She's going to make the point right now. Oh. McDonald's is connected to the Clintons. They chop up the I bodies mean, Bill and Clinton put them into a lot the of sausage and hamburgers. So... People are being cannibals. <laughs> 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 Bill Clinton is connected to the Clint Bill Clinton is connected to McDonald's the same way we're connected to Tad Steak. Yeah. It's still in <laughs> us. Yeah. Chop yeah. up the bodies and put them into the sausage and hamburgers. People are being cannibalized. Is she doing the black Look Twitter clapping thing? <laughs> yes, right now? yes. Oh my god. Yes. Yeah, somebody had an argument with me over that. Only one person. You know what? Go look it up. That's she has one. By the follower. way, go look <laughs> it up. Human Me Found in McDonald's started as a Create your own news prank trick that <laughs> went viral. Uh, anyway, here's the let's let's we got to watch a little more of this. I mean, this is well, let's be clear. There's a lot of crap in McDonald's. But no gets, kind of meat, right? It, it gets exaggerated human. into human meat. <laughs> For that, you know what? Go look it up. Rabbi Finkelstein, who worships Satan in the synagogue of Satan, who is Rabbi Finkelstein? admits it to a man who worships. In the Jewish synagogue of Yahweh, there's two different types of Jews. Jesus came at them. <laughs> McDonald's is connected to the Clinton Foundation as well as Monsanto. Monsanto is connected to the Clinton Foundation. Everything is the Clintons. Everything is the Clintons. <laughs> but wait, which kind of Jews are the Clintons then? If there's two kinds, which which kind are they? The Yahweh Jews or the Satan Jews? Claire, I've got much more to show you. Ooh, what's See, up with Claire? I'm coming at you. Claire's, they sell those little shitty pieces of jewelry in the mall, <laughs> and they have babies in them. And then eclairs, what do you think the cream is? <laughs> oh, man, no wonder I like it so much. This is delicious. Keep on sucking. <laughs> Don't look this at me. No, she's <laughs> she's <laughs> looking at it. She's showing a Jolly Rancher. <laughs> I was going to say, is this, is this a uh, Journey song that I missed? <laughs> it's, it's a Jolly Rancher uh Ad and it's and the ad is keep on sucking. Obviously, the pun being on their candy. Uh huh. Hard candy is pedophile code. <laughs> what is she saying? Code? What is that? Can you parse that for me? Like, what is that? Mean? I think pedophile it's code? like they're trying to recruit kids. Like they're they, with hard eat candy. The candy. I don't know. So like, no, I think the code. Candy. It's like that's a signal that there's kid bits in here. We have code to let you know what products. 
mm. are pedophile but friendly. But she's saying Jolly Rancher is pedophile code. Like, how, how does that... Well, the keep on sucking maybe is the code. It's oh, oh, it's the, oh it's keep the, that's sucking. the slogan that's yeah. actually... I thought she was just saying No, that. I think Rob said that that was actually in oh, the ad, I'm right? sorry, I missed yeah. The keep on sucking. Keep on sucking is on yeah. the Jolly Rancher. Yeah, I got you. Uh, packaging. So, like, she thinks it tells the kids to keep sucking the pedophiles' dicks? You I'm think this sure. is for me? Let's talk about the children. <laughs> we'll talk about the children. Here we go. Sure. Let's talk about the children. Let's talk about the children. In your food. Why does she have to keep shouting this? I, She's I can't very, this is stand serious. people She's like showing this. Sour Sweet Patch Kids. Sour she has to gone. get across the kids point rule. how important this is, Noah. Oh, okay. So, it's Sour Patch Kids... And then there's like graffiti on the design that says rule. So it says kids rule. Okay. Which okay. means something, apparently. Let's see what she says. She's just breathing. <laughs> she needs Where's to... her fart? Is she gonna burn? She's <laughs> very overwhelmed. Red shoes. Oh, my God. Sacrifice. The reference. Child sacrifice. What does he have to do with In this? In your food. Is Trump going to take the down red shoes? The joke is on Uno? you. <laughs> the joke is on you. I watched Wrestle Kingdom, saw red shoes. Not a good person, folks. <laughs> I love that three people get this reference here. <laughs> Who cares? It's a little more of a crazy. Oh, the sweet life. It's just red shoes. Oh, I see. If 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 a character is wearing red shoes and. You know, Wheaties box or whatever. Yeah. This is a Wheaties. That's also pedophile it's code. pedophile code. Who, who deciphers yeah, that? Tracy's Hugh screaming. does. Panther's here. The Panther is here. The Panther? Black Panther? I'm not going to apologize the tiger? for my knowledge. She's the Panther and she's here and she's not going to apologize. Whew. Come at me, bro. Oh, <laughs> she's talking to you, Rob. Shlomo, doesn't he have that I'm ready that for your impact. Yeah. I got sounds like your her. threats. Could you describe this woman to me, Robert? Tar she looks like, uh, you know, basically any wine mom. Like, um, fra frail, short, blonde bob. Okay. She yeah. looks kind of like um, uh, a really cracked out Emma Stone. Oh wow, that's yeah. terrifying. older. Well, Emma Stone's mom, if she was on meth. Oh. Mm -hmm. Target. I'm a money target, that, people. Yeah. Nobody cares. It's true. She looks like a, a poor woman's. Uh, who who is the the woman on uh, on SNL who was on Weekend oh, Update in the first season with uh, Dan Aykroyd? Jane Curtin. Jane Curtin. Uh, yes. Okay. Yeah, a little a bit. poor. I can see that. Except for you guys. But the panther, the pain in Tracy Herman's eyes, is here. Who's Tracy Herman? Is that her? She is Tracy Joe Remington, apparently. Not the panther is that her Q name, Tracy Herman? She really likes the monsters. <laughs> I don't care anymore. Come back. Come here and bash me. Because God is going to get you. He's going to get you. I have been through enough. <sighs> probably true you guys know it i don't have to apologize for anything you don't and i won't oh okay i won't be stupid <laughs> <laughs> now i'm gonna show you something else when honey bee honey Jolly boo boo is involved in this Jolly ranchers, spit them out it's right there on the package in front of you cannibalism they're putting it in your food Children are being cannibalized. Spirit cooking the world. How great would it be if, like, a little bass line started playing and all of a sudden Queen of Vagina walked into the frame <laughs> and just started doing a song? They did, like, a duet. Yeah. She should sing this woman's speech I as lyrics. Oh, my God. <laughs> Out here. Come at Buckle me, bro. Up, means something completely what? different when it's Queen of Vagina saying it. Any day. Vagina. <laughs> Kids in your in your in your in your food. She bends Kids. over and starts shooting Jolly Ranchers out of her pussy. Oh. oh my god, that was so loud. Any day they can come after me. 
Nobody cares. <laughs> you want to see something? Yes. Let me show you something. My vagina. Honey, <laughs> honey, honey, bee, honey bee, if you go watch Hagman report when Honey Bee was bringing this out, Heart Progress is a pedophile advocacy group. They the came advocacy. after me. They, oh, they came after me and they were going to dox me. They did dox me. And that's when I brought my real name out. People are accusing me of not putting this information out. I put this information out over a year and a half ago. Also, She's like some shakes listen. of some kind. You're Probably the same, but she seems very she medicated. Yeah. Not enough. Yeah, you she seems like she sick. lacks medication. Well, yeah. the science can only do so much. <laughs> Did I'm lying? Is this her at a four? Is God what you're saying? Knock you down. I mean, this could just be the limits of what the drugs can do. I mean, <laughs> you know what I mean? <sighs> So how did you find this, Rob? Just on Twitter? Yeah! Tracy's screaming! Panther's here! The Panther is here! Is that going to be yeah, the episode Tracy title? The Panther is here. I'm afraid we'll get lost I in SEO apologize. for this thing. Uh, maybe not then. I'm not going to apologize for my knowledge! Oh, God. I've been there, honey. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like pop tarts because they have little babies in them. Cannibalism! <laughs> they need to do a duet. Seriously.